When we think of heroes in World War II, images of valiant soldiers and courageous leaders often come to mind. However, there is one remarkable hero whose story is both extraordinary and heartwarming. Wojtek, the Syrian brown bear who was enlisted as a soldier and rose to the rank of corporal during the war. This video delves into the incredible journey of Wojtek, the bear who captured the hearts of those who served alongside him and left an indelible mark on the annals of military history. A Unique Beginnings The story of Wojtek began in 1942 in the rugged mountains of Iran. A young hunter found an orphan bear cub and decided to sell him to a group of Polish soldiers who were stationed nearby. The soldiers, members of the Polish Corps, had been forced to leave their homeland after the Nazi and Soviet invasions of Poland in 1939. Now, they were part of a larger Allied force fighting against Axis powers of the Middle East. The bear cub quickly won the hearts of the Polish soldiers, who named him Wojciech, which means joyful warrior or smiling warrior in Polish. As the days passed, it became evident that Wojciech was no ordinary bear. He possessed a curious and gentle nature, endearing himself to everyone he encountered. Wojtek's Unconventional Military Career Wojtek's presence at the military camp created a unique and heartwarming bond between the soldiers and their newfound companion. Initially, he was treated as a beloved mascot and his mischievous antics brought moments of joy and laughter amid the harsh realities of war. He quickly became a cherished symbol of camaraderie and hope for the Polish soldiers who had endured so much hardship. As Wojtek grew, so did his involvement in the daily activities of the military camp. He began to imitate the soldiers, copying their actions, and soon he was carrying out military drills with them. His natural strength and agility proved useful during these exercises, and it became clear that Wojtek's potential was far greater than that of an ordinary mascot. In 1943, as the Polish U Corps prepared to embark on a new chapter of their military campaign, they faced a logistical challenge. The Corps was scheduled to sail to Italy, and the soldiers were prohibited from bringing pets or mascots on board the transport ships. To overcome this hurdle, the Polish soldiers made a bold and unprecedented move. They officially enlisted Wojtek into the Polish army. A Soldier Among Men Wojtek's official military enlistment turned him into a symbol of unity and courage for the Polish U Corps. He was given his own paybook, registration number, and rank of private. However, Wojtek's participation in military life was far from symbolic. He actively contributed to the war effort, performing a variety of tasks that were both practical and morale-boosting. One of Wojtek's notable contributions was his role as a pack bearer. During battles and troop movements, he carried heavy artillery shells and boxes of ammunition, using his formidable strength to assist the soldiers. His participation in this crucial task not only lightened the load for the men, but also provided a source of inspiration and motivation amidst the challenges of war. Beyond his physical duties, Wojtek's presence boosted the morale of the Polish soldiers, he became a beloved mascot and a constant companion during their off-duty hours, engaging in playful wrestling matches and offering comfort during moments of distress. Wojtek's unconditional loyalty and affection forged a unique bond between him and the soldiers, transcending the boundaries of species. Wojtek's Journey to Italy In 1944, the Polish U Corps set sail for Italy, and Wojtek's journey across the Mediterranean Sea was yet another extraordinary chapter in his life. As he boarded the transport ship Asif Batori, alongside his human comrades, he became the only bear ever to be officially drafted into a military campaign. Wojtek's journey to Italy was filled with anecdotes of his interactions with the crew and fellow soldiers on board. From consuming copious amounts of condensed milk to playfully wrestling with the sailors, he quickly endeared himself to everyone on the ship. News of the bear soldiers spread far and wide, capturing the imaginations of people around the world. Wojtek in the Battle of Monte Cassino Upon reaching Italy, Wojtek's valor and presence continued to make an impact. His first taste of combat came during the grueling Battle of Monte Cassino in 1944. As the Polish Ia Corps fought to break through the German lines, Wojtek displayed incredible courage and composure in the face of danger. 
During the battle, Wood Tech was observed by eyewitnesses carrying crates of ammunition to the front line, seemingly undeterred by the explosions and chaos around him. His bravery and steadfastness under fire earned him the promotion to the rank of corporal, a title that solidified his status as a true soldier among men. Wojtek's Post-War Life As the war drew to a close, Wojtek's journey did not end on the battlefield. After the Allied victory in Italy, the Polish U Corps was stationed in Scotland, where Wojtek and his fellow soldiers found themselves in a new chapter of their lives. There, Wojtek's fame and legend grew, as he continued to captivate the hearts of people across the globe. In Scotland, Wojtek became a beloved figure, captivating the local population and the media. He was often seen enjoying his favorite treat of beer and cigarettes, which he had developed a fondness for during the war. The sight of the bear soldier enjoying a drink with the soldiers became an iconic image that symbolized the bond between man and beast. Wojtek's Legacy Wojtek lived out the rest of his days in Edinburgh Zoo, where he became a cherished member of the community. He passed away in 1963, leaving behind a legacy that endures to this day. His memory lives on through numerous memorials, books, documentaries, and a statue erected in his honor. Beyond the tangible tributes, Wojtek's legacy is one of resilience, courage, and the extraordinary bond that can form between humans and animals. His story remains an uplifting testament to the strength of the human spirit, even in the darkest times of conflict. So that's it for today. If you like this video, then please hit the like and subscribe button for more videos. Thanks for watching.